This is just in about 20, 30 minutes that this picked up. I don't think we've even gotten the thunder snow yet. Longer. We do have a blizzard warning in effect for Douglas, Scarpy, and Potawan and Paradise. We have a blizzard warning according to the National Weather Service and Valley for Omaha since January of 1998. So it's been a while. There's a winter storm warning for Lincoln. That lasts until noon. Speaking of those wind gusts, here are a few of those 41 mile per hour wind gusts in New York, 46 in Omaha, and I don't expect those to die down any time soon. This is how things work. We're in the 9 to 12. A little bit right here. Douglas and Southern County. County. Our county, county is in the 10 to 15. I'm on the edge here. The thing here is the county is in the 9 to 12 across the area. We had it tracking through parts of Kansas. That's when it really started to deepen. We got all that moisture in here, had that thunder snow, and now we're still dealing with the bands in western portions of Douglas County of one to two inches an hour. And we'll be dealing with that for another three hours or so. So we could still add another four or five inches in some spots to the snow totals already. Of course, we'll keep you updated on snow totals and the forecast as we head into the afternoon hours and for the rest of this morning. Keep it here, right here on the center. Okay. Down King 29, close to the South Dakota border, the Missouri border, Interstate 80, close from Council Bluffs East to a Bell, Iowa exit. Now, other highways in Western Iowa also close. <laughs> This is what it looks like out my front door. And it's bad all over in our area. I called into work. And of course, my husband still has to go to work because he works for the city of Council Bluff Streets and Alleys Division. He doesn't have the excuse of when it's blizzard conditions like this that he can call it a snow day because that's when they need him the most. He is on snow removal when uh, it's like this. So no matter what it's like, he's got to get to work. So we have a four-wheel drive vehicle that he drove this morning. And it wasn't too bad when he left at 4.30 this morning, except for the ice. But by the time he got to Council Bluffs, it's an hour drive to work to Council Bluffs from here. By the time he got to Council Bluffs, it was right out conditions. So it's pretty bad. He called me and he said, you are not going to work. He said, if this is coming your way, you're not going to work. No arguments here. and see the birds. the street in the parking lot of the other one housing. I've already gone. <laughs> 
my work and there's no school and a lot of the area schools and so I'm staying home again today and we got a lot of the shovel use the snow blow until the chain broke and have to finish with the shovel again and I'm gonna have to shovel again because the snow is still blowing It's a mess out here. Look at how big the drift of the wind is. So three foot.